What do you want? What is it? Because you're doing fine. I don't I, want to talk I, to you. I want to say hi. Okay, bye bye. No, 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 no. When you're worried about something, you stop doing it. You stop making the same mistake over and over and over again. I don't want you to talk to me at all. Because you never do what you say you will do. Bye bye. He's grandpa. You know grandpa. He's my grandpa. Yes, oh yeah. My parents don't really know my son. He's my first son, he's just 10 months old. But there was an incident at Christmas where my wife was holding the baby in her arms. I had to go out to the car to get something. And when I came back in, Robin had taken my son sort of forcefully and he was drunk. With Robin living at their house, my wife doesn't want to go over there I don't feel it's safe and it's just not comfortable. That's my guy. There. You're very clever. You're very clever. Oh. Yeah. Scott and I have never been with Robin in quite a long time. All three of us together at once. Where's Robin? He's down in his room. Coming up? I think so. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what's gonna happen. I got a good one. There you go. That one right there. Well, you can't roll it, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that's how you do it, isn't it? Yeah, what's spinning on it? Yeah, they got yeah. to take a big, have a big chunk. What's the big guy eating there, Scott? Uh, I don't know, some sort of puff. Some sort of a puff of some sort. You got your own chair and everything. How old's Charlie now, now, Scott? Uh, 10 months? Yep. He's a cute kid, Scott. Where were you? I was downstairs. And yes, I do drink. A lot. Don't seem to do much else. Delicious chicken. It's really good, Mom. How about those Oilers? What a punch in the face. That's nice. I will come across the table in a second and punch you in the face. That's the reason we don't come around with Charlie, Robin. You don't think it pisses me off that my son doesn't see his grandparents because we don't feel safe coming around here? But you don't really give us an option. Why do you can't say tell something you're gonna nice do. to me? No. No? Stop, you guys. When you stop, Robin, stop. You're upsetting mom. Oh, not for not. I've been setting, upsetting mom for 20 years. I can get you right now with a fork in the face. Robin, you can enough. You can barely stand up. Scott's trying to help you. I'm sorry I make everyone feel uncomfortable and blah, blah, blah. Well, maybe it's time to look inwards and see why nobody wants to be around you. My kids want to be around me. I don't know, I rarely even hear you mention them. Never tell me I don't care about my kids. Prove you, you just, you keep... Prove that you like those kids. Sober yourself up and get them back. I'm allowed to talk to my kid once a week. And doesn't that make you want to maybe you get better? I can't go home. Yeah, this is the consequences of what I you've done. I can't go home. You act like there's nothing you can do about it. It has everything to do with me. And, it has, and there is something you can do about it.
This conversation is over. I'm leaving the table. Scott, you're going to leave the table, and the conversation is finished. My family has all but disintegrated since Robin has come back in the picture. We used to be so close. He affects everybody. He's ruining everyone's life.